The Victoria Foundation's Vital Signs Report has identified arts and culture as important to the quality of life for those living in Greater Victoria, which means supporting the arts community is important too. And that support can come in many forms. V. Cooper explains. Since 1997, Victoria's Canadian College of Performing Arts has honed the talents of students passionate about performing. So many gravitate towards stage, but they're in movies, they're producing, they're directing, they're teachers, they're uh, ambassadors for the arts. Two years tuition at CCPA is around $38,000, but through grants and fundraising, the school pays 20000 of that. We actually raise half the cost of every Canadian student's tuition. We're very lean. We have a staff of five or six. All the money that, that we get in basically goes to the program and to the students. June Lockhart, who you might remember from Lost in Space and Lassie. Which brings us to this man, Richard Lucas, professional actor, supporter of the arts, and huge Lucille Ball fan. I used to write my own Lucy shows, and I'd play Mr. Mooney, and I'd make Mary and the poor red-headed girl be Lucy, and we'd do them in the lunchroom. This would have been the opening of... Lucas ended up touring on stage with Gail Gordon, Mr. Mooney, after the Lucy show ended, and that led to meeting his idol. She was really, really kind to me, and on the last day I was there, she came up and she said, you want me to sign something for you, honey? And I said, sure, thanks, Lucy, because I wasn't going to ask. And she ripped off the front page of Gail's script and signed it. A treasured piece from Richard's collection. I used to have a huge amount of memorabilia. Most of it has been sold off now for charity. Richard's latest donation will go to CCPA, a gown and cape worn by Lucille Ball. I did donate the dress uh, to the school and we had a very successful fundraiser at the Empress Hotel. Richard and the school then talked about auctioning off the gown, perhaps Sotheby's or Christie's, but then fate intervened. This amazing opportunity came up with the new CBC series Four Rooms. Picture Dragon's Den blended with the Antiques Roadshow, treasures hopefully bid upon by at least one of four buyers. They're tough, they're tough, but um, I think it's going to be really fun to watch. Richard and the college find out tonight if there'll be money coming to the students. CBC's Four Rooms begins at 8. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.